In the last 18 months, we've had to confront the biggest economic choices the world has faced since the 1930s. Just remember it was only a year ago that the world was looking over a precipice and Britain was in danger. And I knew that unless I acted decisively and immediately, the recession could descend into a Great Depression with millions of people's jobs, homes and savings at risk. And times of great challenge mean choices of great consequence. Now, what of the big choices that this country has to make now? To help young people into work or to see like the 1980s, a wasted generation? And I'll tell you the choice. We are making it to reject every piece of conservative advice. Instead, we will ensure school leavers get training, guarantee that young unemployed get work experience, expand university places and increase, not cut, the apprenticeships we need. Because what let the world down last autumn was not just bankrupt institutions, but a bankrupt ideology. What failed was the conservative idea that markets always self-correct, but never self-destruct. What failed was the right-wing fundamentalism that says you can just leave everything to the markets and says that free markets are not just free, but values free. You know, one day last October, the executive of a major bank told me that his bank needed only overnight finance and no long-term support from the government. The next day, I found that this bank was going under with debts that were among the biggest of any bank anywhere at any time in history. And you know, bankers had lost sight of basic, basic British values. They'd lost sight of the values of acting responsibly and acting fairly. And these are the values that we, the hard-working majority, live by every day. When markets falter and banks fail, it's the jobs and the homes and the security of the squeezed middle that are hit the hardest. It's the hard-pressed, hard-working majority, the person with a trade, the small business owner, the self-employed. It's the classroom assistant, the worker in the shop, the builder on this site. It's the millions of people who do their best and their bit and in return simply want their families to get on and not just get by.